Over there! It's huge! I've never seen anything like it! Ugh! There was a beast just like it in the old schoolhouse! Stay back, Grandfather! Milliam and I can take care of this! Yeah! This'll be a piece of cake! Lemmy! <laughs> go, go, go! This beast is downright nasty compared to the others around here. We are so screwed. Run away, now! Forget about me, just run! Elisa, Milliam! What? Huh? Elisa, Milliam! Are you both all right? We'll back you up. Well, if it isn't Gaius, and you're... Green! You're totally alive! And Claire's with you too? Double score! We can talk later. Our first priority is taking down this beast. Just be careful. This is no ordinary beast. It's a cryptid! Gotcha! Ready? It'll be fun! Here I go! Marcus, activate! <laughs> Too slow! My turn. Do this. Sorry, would you mind? I'll try at least. Keep it up, everyone. Right out. Here up. Leave this to me. No more. Mortal. Now! Got you! My turn. Let's move! Alright, let's do this! Okay, it's good. My turn. Here I go! Too slow. My turn. Eliminating targets. Okay. Keep it up, everyone. My turn. All right, let's do this! Okay, it's good. Onward. No more! Mortal arrives! Now! Got you! My turn! Here goes! Overdrive! Overdrive. 
burn to ash. Fall! Now's our chance. Let's go, everyone! Yes, sir! Yes, Leave it to me! All right. Suppressing target. Mirror device activated. Orbital laser fire. Mission complete. May you rest in peace. Let's move! There! Ha! Now's our chance! An opening! I'll handle it. Here I go! Ha! I'll set you up! Cool! We won! More than cool, we were great! Down it goes. Yeah, that should have done it. Oh, thank Adios. But what a monster! The one in the old schoolhouse was strong too, but this seemed even stronger. You called it a cryptid, right? Right. Ordinarily, cryptids shouldn't exist on this plane to begin with. But there's something abnormal taking place here in Erebonia. And it's not the war. I can only assume that abnormality having an effect on the land is what caused it to appear. Some abnormality? Are you implying that something else might be happening at the same time as the war? <laughs> Claire! I'm so happy to see you! Milliam, I'm so glad that you're alright. It's wonderful to see you again. <laughs> yeah, same to you! That new outfit you got looks smoking on you, too! <laughs> smoking, huh? <laughs> It's really you, isn't it? It's really, really you? I can't believe I'm finally seeing you again! Neither can I. So, um, have you been doing okay? I'm glad to see you were able to find Gwyn at least. Yeah, I... Wait a minute! Never mind me! What about you? Where have you been ever since we parted back at Trista? And how did you end up coming here? And I can see how you would be with Celine, but how come you're with the others? <laughs> it's a long story. I'll fill you in on all the details you want later, but that'll have to do for now. Sorry for being a pain. Oh, enough of that. I should be the one apologizing. I'm so sorry for all we put you through. Huh? What are you sorry for? We knew just how much it would hurt you to part with us like that. We knew our choice would bring you nothing but suffering and misery. We knew that you'd blame yourself for what happened, for not being able to find a better way. Uh. But that was the only choice we had. At the end of the day, we believed that was the best thing for all of us, and for this country as a whole. Even if it meant willingly forcing all of the burden onto you. I'm so, so sorry, Reen. Please. You've got nothing to apologize for. You're right. 
you didn't have a choice. There was no other way. But here we are, together again. And it was only because I could trust in all of you that I was able to come this far. I couldn't be more grateful. If anything, I should be thanking you. So, that's exactly what I'm going to say. Thank you, Alisa. <laughs> you big goof. Thank you, Reen. Thank you for coming back to us. And from this point on, I won't be going anywhere without you. <laughs> oh boy. <laughs> Always good to see young people living up their youth. I'm surprised you've got no problems with sharing a passionate embrace like that in front of your old grandpa, though. Not that I mind, of course. <gasps> uh, it was just... I got all emotional seeing him again, and don't go reading anything into it, okay? Sounding mighty suspicious to me. <laughs> okay, it's Milliam time! Whoa, hold up! Oh, I missed you so much, Reen! Wasn't expecting you to be hanging out with Claire, though. <laughs> well, suffice it to say, a lot's happened. I wasn't expecting you to be with Elisa and Gaius either, to be honest. I would have thought you returned to the Intelligence Division. Oh, Reen, that's adorable. You should know me by now. I'm as much a part of Class 7 as the rest of you. And that's why you came for us, right? Because we're classmates? Yeah, you're right. Class 7 wouldn't be complete without you, Milliam. I hope we can keep counting on you. <laughs> yep, always and forever. Oh, it's nice seeing us all together like this. And hopefully, we can find the rest of us soon too. I'm so happy for you all. Allow me to offer my congratulations too. I'm sure you must have a lot of catching up to do, but I think we should return to the lake for now. I managed to get a look at how things are in the Watchtower. The Watchtower? Lacan did say that you'd gone to investigate something. It looked like the damage from the attack earlier this year had been repaired, but are you suggesting it has something to do with the orbital communication problems in the region? It certainly does. It's got this really annoying thingy on it, you see.